Hey guys, it's Noelle. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be another Forever 21 haul. Oh my goodness, the amount of positive feedback that I got on my last Forever 21 haul that I just posted like two weeks ago is insane. I think that video is already at 29,000 views and that's the most views I've ever gotten on a video on here on my channel, so that's so exciting. So I'm assuming you guys really love Forever 21, so I'm here to bring you guys another video since you guys love that one so much. But this time, this one is for the fall time. I picked up some pieces on forever21.com that I think would be perfect for the fall season this year, and I'm so excited to share with you guys what I found online. Don't forget to like this video down below and then subscribe so you guys don't miss any more of my videos. Let me know down below in the comment section if you guys want me to do another Forever 21 haul, if you really just love this whole Forever 21 theme here, or if you guys want me to do another clothing store, whether it's another affordable store like Windsor or Pretty Little Thing or ASOS or something like that. Um, I'm always open to doing more clothing hauls and showing you guys how you can find affordable pieces on those online websites. So um, yeah, without further ado, let's get straight into the video. Okay, the first piece is a sweater dress. So it comes in a couple different dress colors online, but I wanted the white one really badly, but that was already sold out. So I ended up going with the yellow one. And I love this color for the fall time. It is the perfect mustard color. This sweater, I was actually really scared about this sweater because I thought it was going to be super like itchy because most of the time, a lot of times with Forever 21, their sweaters are really low quality just because you're paying a really low price for them. So they're not gonna be the best quality, but this actually ended up being super, super soft and I'm pretty, I'm pretty surprised at the quality of this sweater. Um, the only thing is I don't know if I personally love this color and it on me. I feel like the white color would look better on me. Um, I'll show you guys in a second, but I wanted to pair these with this sweater dress with like knee high boots. Um, let me know down below if you guys think it looks awkward on me or if you guys like it. Um, I'm not sure, but I think I'm going to order or try and find the, the cream color in this, but such great quality and it's long enough where it's not like really super short. It's the perfect length and really great quality. I got mine in a size small and the price ended up being $17.90 for a sweater dress. That's a really good price. This next piece I'm about to show you guys is by far my favorite item that I found in this haul. It just fit me perfectly and I didn't think it was gonna fit well when I got it and I saw it on the picture, but I just love the plaid pattern and it ended up fitting me so nice. I'm obsessed with this. So it is this plaid jumpsuit right here. I'm obsessed with jumpsuits. It's like a romper for the fall time basically. Um, so you have a top and bottom option. You don't really have to think about your outfit and it's super cute. I was going to pair these, this jumpsuit with the like white booties because they're super in right now or even just like a pair of brown or black booties would be so cute with even a sweater over top. But I just love it. It's just at the waist because there's a tie right here. It fits so well. It has this like orange cream and black pattern on it, which is perfect for the fall time. The pants lay right above the ankle, so they're not all the way down, so it's perfect to wear with like those booties. I think this is so cute, and it was so inexpensive. So I got my size in a size small, and the price was $29.30, which $30 isn't, I mean, everyone thinks Forever 21 is super inexpensive, but I think $30 for a jumpsuit is a really good price. You can't beat that, and it's such great quality. It's a little thin, but I would always wear like a layering top over underneath of it and like leggings, you would never even see it and you would have a little bit of warmth. I think this is gonna be so cute for the fall time and I can't wait to style this. This next piece is just a basic sweater and you can never have enough basic sweaters in your wardrobe, I'm telling you. Especially where I live, it's freezing cold here and I need to buy a ton of sweaters. Um, so I, I envisioned pairing this sweater, just like a camel sweater with this plaid skirt that I ordered from Pretty Little Thing. I will, I don't know when it's gonna come in, I'm waiting for it to come in the mail. So if I do get it and style it by the time I upload this video, I will post it here. But you guys can follow me on Instagram, you can see how I'm going to style all these pieces and just style a ton of fashion on my Instagram in general. I post there every single day, so you guys can go over there for some fashion inspo. But I just picked up this normal camel color sweater. I love this color, I love camel and black together, especially for the fall time, I think it's such a beautiful combo. Um, and even this with like a pair of plaid pants would go really great, again, it's a simple sweater and you can't go wrong and it's really great quality again I was kind of nervous about this one as well because of the fact that like their sweaters are hit or miss really and ordering online you can't tell what the quality is but I ended up loving this it's the perfect sweater and I got it in a size small and this is $19.90 Okay, the next two pieces that I'm gonna share with you guys aren't actually a set, but I kind of made them a set and you kind of can't tell unless you're like super close to me. But this is a super trendy outfit that I'm about to share with you guys and I was like unsure about it when I first have seen it all over like Instagram when it comes to 
New York Fashion Week. It was so big, um, and I wrote a blog post about like what my what I think the upcoming fall trends are, and this was one of them. So I think the cute suits, like cute plaid suits or like printed plaid suits, are so in right now, and I was kind of like iffy about it because it's not really my style. Um, I don't really wear blazers. It's not really my thing, but I gave it a try and I actually really, really love this outfit together because it's not super masculine. I feel like sometimes when I wear blazers, it makes me look super masculine, but paired with like this tight, short little skirt, not too short, um, and like the bodysuit that I'm paired it with because I took pictures today in them and I styled them. It ended up being really, really beautiful and super classy, but a little bit sexy because I had like a sheer bodysuit underneath of it and it looks so good. I'll pop a picture up here so you guys can see how I styled it, but I am obsessed with this trend. So the first piece I got is just this plaid blazer right here. It fits perfectly. It's not too oversized where it's like, it's wearing me and I'm not wearing it. It's the perfect size. I got it in a size small and this is $37.90. So I mean, it is a little pricey for a blazer, but it's a really great quality and it's not too expensive because I've seen other blazers like I went to Zara, theirs are pretty expensive. And other places right now, it's just a super trendy piece and it's not too expensive for a blazer. It fits perfectly and I think it's so flattering on and yeah, not much to say about it. So then I paired it with this skirt right here, which actually doesn't match because there's a faint like sand color stitching in this jacket that isn't in this. But it ended up working because you can't really tell unless you're super close to me. And if you're that close to me, you need to go away. So again, it's just this black and white plaid skirt. It fits super well. It's very form-fitting um, and it gives that feminine appeal while you're adding the masculine, masculine appeal to it. So you're mixing feminine and masculine, which I'm obsessed with. And it just went really well together. And it's, it's a very affordable place to try a trend out if you're not really sure about it. Oh. Oh, I forgot to tell you the size and the, and the amount for this one. Okay, so I got this in a size small as well, and it ended up being $15.90 for this skirt. Okay, I have two more items to show you. This is the last clothing item, then I'll show you the pair of booties that I picked up from Forever 21. But I am obsessed with this jacket. I think it's gonna be so beautiful for the fall time, and it was such a great find on Forever 21. I'm so, so excited. So this is from their contemporary line. If you guys don't know about Forever 21, I really hope you guys know about this line in Forever 21 because it is the best part of that store. So the contemporary line, you can find it in the stores as well, but it's super easy just to shop it online. There's a tab that says contemporary and it has the best stuff listed on the website. It is by far the best style in there. You need to check it out. And this jacket is from that section. So I got it in a size small and it ended up being $47.90 for this long trench coat, which I think is such a good price. It's such great quality. It's kind of light. It's not a heavier trench coat, but I like that because then I can layer with a sweater so it's not super thick on me. And I love the pattern. I thought it was gonna be a little bit more rose color. I don't know how it's picking up on camera, but it ended up being more of like a muted orange, like a burnt orange. And I thought it was gonna be more of like a rose pink, which I'm kind of sad about because I was gonna match it with the booties that I was gonna show you in about five seconds. But overall, I really love this color anyway because this is such a great color for the fall time. And it has a print houndstooth on it. Super trendy. I love prints right now. Prints are so in. And I think it's so freaking cute. So yeah. Last but not least, these are the pair of booties that I was going to pair with the jacket. I might still because they're not like too far off, but I saw these in store and I didn't get them when I first saw them and I knew that I had to get them when I was ordering online. I think they're so freaking cute. So there's these blush pink, which I love blush pink. It's like one of my favorite colors and to wear and just in general. And these are such great quality booties. They're kind of like the sock booty trend. The heel isn't too high, so they're very wearable and walkable. I think they're just so cute. They are suede and they're just really great quality. So I got them in my normal size, which I'm a size eight, and it ends up being $34.90 for a pair of suede booties. I think these are so cute and so trendy. I think they're adorable. The sock booty is so in right now as well. And you can't go wrong with a pair of good with a good pair of shoes. Okay, that is the end of my Forever 21 haul. I really hope you guys enjoyed all the pieces that I shared with you guys today. I am obsessed with all the pieces and I cannot wait to style them. And I'm just so excited to get for it to get colder here so I can start wearing them. It's 90 degrees today and it's so hot, so I can't wear any of that yet. But I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and let me know down below what your favorite product was. Product. I feel like I'm doing a makeup video. Let me know down below what your favorite item was that I shared with you guys today in this haul, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.